Hello everyone, Mr. Zas here. Uh, today I'm gonna talk about Maris Bredis, the Latvian number one boxer of all time. The champion himself. And his plans of moving to super heavyweight. He's been saying he's not sure if he's gonna stay at the cruiserweight. Again, we need to remember that maybe staying as a, in cruiserweight as world champion is more profitable than moving to super heavyweight and making more money but not being that world champion even though seems like Briedis has been talking with Polish boxer Marius Wak regarding upcoming fight which will indicate that he is thinking about moving to super heavyweight and he is looking to fight someone much much bigger and try out his like super heavyweight just seeing how harder would be for him to face someone who is actually much bigger much stronger but is still able to throw back some shots remember guys Myris Bredis is good he's a very very actually good boxer but then again he's only 6'1 He's good size boxer for cruiserweight, where 6'1 is good size and 6'3 is a great size. I mean height. But in super heavyweight, most guys are 6'4 to 6'6. 6'6 being a good height and everything above 6'6 in super heavyweight is a great, great height. Regardless, the most guys are 6'4. 6465 that's that's like the mid range in super heavyweight so if Myris Bredis moves up to super heavyweight he gonna be quite sure guy there so I think for for him this will gonna be kind of a test fight how hard or how easy he could deal with someone as Myris Wack a guy who's very big he's about 6667 very big very tall we saw that in previous fights where he was fighting against Huey Fury who is 66 and he was yeah he was about good two inches taller than him uh he delivered a good fight there he showed that he still has something left in him but will he gonna be fighting next i understand that the fight is not taking place now because they are waiting for better venue and fill it up with some people they want the venue may be to be in Poland, that's not clear, but I think that the talks are they want to make this fight in Poland, kind of revenge fight, uh, you know, get those fans going from the previous fight, which was a bit dirty, where Briedis was fighting uh, against Glavatsky, and there was some elbows involved, and some punching behind the back, uh, so, you know, it's a good selling point, you know, good point to sell the tickets, revenge, you know, that Marius Wack will gonna try to revenge his... Uh, countryman's defeat but uh, yeah good selling point likewise I think Briedis would just fly like a butterfly and sting like a bee and that's about it but uh, overall if he wins this fight if Briedis wins this fight it doesn't mean he is good for super heavyweight it's just how it is it, it doesn't mean he gonna be able to take guys who are the same size or let's say are 6'6 six, six, but they are ranked top 15 Regardless, I think this is a good, interesting fight. Definitely would be watching. And I would be tuning in. And anyway, guys, leave a like, leave a comment, and please subscribe. Mr. Zas out.